Welcome everybody. Today I'm going to share with you something which I use uh, very often um, and I believe with uh, my hand on my heart that it is one of the most powerful uh, negative energy cleansers uh, in the world. Um, the reason why I believe it is is because of the 10 years I've been working with it and it has proven to help in many situations, whether they are situations of um, a loss of a, uh, a family loved one, um, somebody who has really, really caused you great pain in the family um, by way of attacks. Um, your own feeling of um, emotional sadness, but you don't know why. All of these things, I, I could go on forever, but Trust me when I say, and I really mean this, trust me, um, it works. It really works. Now, Mother Nature gives us everything that we need, and um, science is now starting to realise this more. They're looking more into um, plants, into herbs, into um, fruit, and, and all the other things that Mother Nature gives us. And that, that heals um, the diseases that we have at this moment. Science last week, I think it was last week or the week before, uh, brought out a, a very interesting article. And uh, although I'm not really into science because it's not important, um, it is nice to see that um, when science uh, recognises uh, these things, it, it really makes me chuckle. So science recognised that sage, <laughs> which is what I'm talking about today, when burnt around the body, it actually is proven that it clears away bacteria. Amazing. Now, we don't know much about bacteria, but I can tell you this, when we do get bacteria, there is something wrong. And if we can clear bacteria, then that surely must be something that we're doing right to help the body. So, regardless whether this sounds hocus pocus or whatever, science has said sage works, and it does. And I've known that for years. So how do we use it? We put it into a wooden bowl, any kind of sage, as long as it's dry. Um, I sell it on the website. I am not here to sell my sage. I'm here to show you something that's important. You can buy sage anywhere. People talk about white sage of America. Um, my sage is from the Alpujarras. It, it, it's in Spain. It's the local sage. I don't care what sage you use. It's the same thing. It's the same mother nature it gives you this plant. Use it and wherever you are, just use it, it's fantastic. So, by putting it into a wooden bowl, and quite a thick wooden bowl, uh, you're not gonna burn your hands once you start getting into the, um, the blowing and, and the cinders becoming hotter and hotter, which that's what happens. The secret to burning sage is the smoke. You need as much smoke as you can. Buying um, a lighter with a stick at the end, uh, a little extension, makes a massive difference. You're not gonna burn yourself, okay? So, quite simply, light. And you light for maybe, I think, 30 or 40 or 50 seconds, okay? So that's what I'm gonna do. So you light. Um, I'm gonna try and keep this video as short as I can, so um, you can now start to see the smoke coming off. And then you keep blowing. So the more you blow, the more the smoke and the more the cinders uh, become hotter and hotter and then it becomes uh, very hot. So what you do is, if you're doing a cleansing on yourself, you find yourself a nice seat and then you start blowing and when the smoke starts to get more and more intense, put it all around your body, work all around your body. I would reckon maybe three minutes to five minutes, that's great. And that's it, it's done. If you're doing a house, you start from the bottom of the house, one corner, and work you around every room, and then go back and forward in that room, um, triangle, share this way, that way, every way, but the secret is to get as much smoke as you can in every room, so you can't even breathe properly. Hey, it, that's even good, because you're cleansing yourself at the same time. Do every room, but make sure that your doors and windows are all closed, and then get out of the house. Leave it about an hour to two hours, come back, open all the doors and windows, and it's done and you'll feel different. And then in a few weeks or months, whatever you think, do you know what? I think it's ready for cleansing again. 
and cleanse it again. There is no set pattern. You don't know how you are uh, um, in an energy level too. If somebody comes into your house and is in a bad energy level, really bad mood or angry or sad, then hey, you might have to cleanse the house again, you know. So don't don't have any set patterns, just feel it. That's what I'm here to do for you. I'm here to ask you to feel, not to listen to other people, but to feel in your house and see how it feels. See how you feel. And if you feel down, just turn to the sage. Just turn, you just never know. It could be the sage that cleanses and clears your aura and gets rid of all that negative energy and you feel better instantly or within a few hours anyway, that's for sure. It really helps me and I've been using it every single week <laughs> here in the center on clients and on myself and of course, in this healing center, the Pure Energy Healing Center. So from mattbyersky.com, I hope you got something from this today. And uh, yeah, uh, email me back and let me know if you did notice a difference. I'm always curious and I'm always happy to know that um, just by watching this few moments that it may have made a difference in your life. Okay, have a lovely day, everybody.